Hans Brim, what a bus, eh? Yo! That's 52. End of the tail, 48. Welcome ladies and gents to another episode of Paz Extreme Fishing. We decided to come for a quick scratching session to Port Edward. Okay, we got, by scratching I mean black bream, uh, the kalyun, which is our national South African fish, uh, bronze bream, stuff like that. So uh, today I'm here with my son, a few of my friends. We're going to have a quick session. Sea's not looking very good, it's got some color, uh, it's got a surge, you know, the wave period. It's affecting us but yeah we're gonna give it a, a shot we're gonna fish hopefully get us a nice kalyun or two uh guys please man subscribe please you guys have been liking some beautiful comments mostly beautiful comments thank you uh and i've been replying to your comments please subscribe the more subscriptions i get the better to grow my channel so please yeah like share subscribe Today we're going to do some traces. I'm going to show you my basic traces, double hooks, circle hooks, uh, how I fish them, how I fish with uh, uh, um, prawn baits, how we fish with crab baits. Tyson's going to do a, a bait presentation. I'm going to do a bait presentation. We're going to start doing bait presentations and traces. Keep the comments coming. You need to know anything. Keep the comments coming. Guys, for those that have subscribed, thank you so much. For those that are going to subscribe, thank you so much. Please. I hope you guys enjoy my video. Stay tuned and let's get to some action. Okay guys, so what I prefer, um, like when I, when I start fishing on the rocks in the morning, uh, is always crab, okay? Uh, I like to use ghost crab, but then again, remember that you have to have a permit for ghost crab, which can be obtained from your post office. I, I like to fish with a diameter of a 0 0.49 fluorocarbon. One no rock point. I use a little three-way power swivel. I put an anti-tangle sleeve. So this is my anti-tangle sleeve. It just avoids the line from, from, from tangling too much when there's a surge. Uh, I fish with a four ounce uh, cone sinker, a uh, 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 bottle sinker in the morning so that my bait can sit in a hole and you know, I, I like to look for that brusher or, or, the, or that uh, uh, black broom in the morning. So guys, once you've dug your crab, this is the way I like to put it. Uh, you shell it, okay. Break it down the center gently. So this is the node where the the, 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 the the pincer comes off from. Take my hook, I put it through there. Slowly I break that piece off by using the hook. I pull it a bit up the line there. So it just fills up my hook. Then I take two together like that. I like to leave that leg dangling, the, the last little leg just as a, a, as, a, you know, as a fish collar basically. Then I put it through there, in there, turn my hook, and that there is my always first morning bait. And I tell you what, most of the times I've, I've got big bronze bream on that, I've got a black bream on that, and, and, and trust me, the brusher eat that. You'll, you'll find a lot of fish eat that, and then the little pickers can't get to it. So that's basically what I'm gonna do. I'm going to find uh, some nice working water. I'm going to have my first throw in that working water. I'm going to keep on trying with crab till uh, maybe an hour, two hours, even if it's three hours, and then I'm going to change and, and, and fish wood for bronze bream. Thank you. Stay tuned. Okay, so my bait for today is going to be half a prawn and one cracker, also known as a sand prawn. Please, you'll have to have a permit to obtain this. So, yeah, let's go. So, basically, my trace today is the same as theirs, just that I'm fishing with a Wano Chino hook. So, just gonna show you how I put this bait. Okay, so I'm gonna peel the head off and I'm gonna shell it. Shell it nice and slowly. 
Okay. the middle okay guys cut it nice in the middle I'm gonna take one piece bring me up the bottom first and bring him a few times bring him up pull it nicely on your line okay On some cotton to that, and some cotton, cotton in the middle. Yeah. Put some extra cotton in the bottom so that your bait can stay straight. Come up it. Nice thin bait guys because as you know the copper brim has small mouth so I want them to the bait. Okay, then I'm gonna add the piece of cracker or sand prawn, whatever you like to the side of it. Cutting it up as well. Cutting them up. Nice as well here yeah, in the bottom. Take some extra cotton on the bottom. So on the top, show my hook is a bit proud, not too proud. Yeah, just gonna make my knot. Oh, oops. And slow down. Slow down. And this is my bait for the copper. As you can see. Okay, thank you. A little longer than a few minutes later. This is on. Woody's cracker and prawn mixture. Nice fish. This is black brim again, all this bench. There we go. See, another black brim. Well done, boy. This is just on. What a nice one, boy. Beautiful Kalyun. Black brim. Beautiful fish. Getting a nice bite here, guys. This is like a nice copper. On, 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 on. But I can feed him all over the bricks there. Okay, I got him. I wonder what this is. Doesn't feel too big. Oh, a beautiful, beautiful cave bass. That's a beautiful lantern eye. Large mouth cave bass. Bass. For cave bass. It's a large mouth cave bass. There's Benji on there with a nice fish. Beautiful copper. Size, huh? Oh, nice. 
this in like an angle bench. Now that's a bench. And you always get those three bumps. There's rims there. Adrian on the side there is on. Spot something. Circle look in the corner. Perfect. Circle look in the corner. It's my bronze brim. That's what they can do. There we go. Perfect book up. That's Adrian. It's me. Is Adrian on there again? That's your bronze brim quarter for the day. Now you can change and fish for black brim. Come closer, dude. Let me get you closer. Perfect. Again. On again. On again. I waited for this guy. Feels like another bronze brim or a little kalyon. Oh, can you see the size of the sea at the back? Huge sea. Ah, a little kalyon. What's that? Ah, bronze brim. Oh, a little kalyon, man. That's a kalyon. That's a little black rim. <coughs> Circle look in the corner. Kalyon. Yeah, so I've been trying the entire morning for for this guy and he never came my way then I decided to change and put my double circle hook with some prawn and cracker and I get rewarded with my kalyon so you see goes to show that doesn't really mean red bait and crab are the best for kalyon they, they're eating Prawn. There we have a beautiful kalyon. Beautiful, beautiful kalyon. Nice little kalyon. Mm -hmm. 
Kill on again. We just did some angle shots in game on the video. Just 